Sacramento, <laughs> Sacramento, pretty like cultural diverse. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I feel like <laughs> nigga came as a poverty that, word. You know what right? I mean? And we just and flipped I got, it. Yeah, and I got I got a lot of white friends who grew up in the streets. I were a couple white friends that grew up in the streets, just like I I did. And they just, they feel like they a nigga just as much as I do. And I like I ain't about to, I, who am I to take that from them? You know what I'm saying? Right? I mean, I mean the only way we can change it. It's to change it. If we keep it to where the white people can't say nigga, then we gonna always coin that term for what it really stood for at the beginning. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like if we let it go, man, the shit will change. Hundred years from now, and people forget about all this, the pain and suffering. We gotta make this shit change. You know what I mean? Mm. Is that what you're talking about when you're talking about you know being black and just growing up and into getting to where you want to be, the struggles and like where you are in life? Is that one of the things that? Yeah, if I if I hold on to those things as a negative. They'll always feel a negative, and I always had that negative space in my brain to, to, to think negatively in that moment. You know what I mean? You gotta let go of that shit. Everybody gotta let go. Once exactly. we let uh, let go, you know what I'm saying? We just choose to be happy. Mm -hmm.